States Congress is holding a public hearing today on UFOs. It's an effort to try and figure out what's known about the sightings and who or what may be behind those sightings. NBC's Gotti Schwartz covers UFOs and aliens for us. He's in Washington, <laughs> D.C. with more on all of it. Gotti, good morning. Hey, yeah, good morning. Our quest for answers has finally brought us to the halls of Congress, where all of a sudden talk of UFOs has come, uh, gone from prompting laughs and snickers to being taken very seriously by some of the most powerful lawmakers who oversee national defense. And today they are hoping to get to the bottom of whatever it is that's flying around in our sky in ways they can't explain. This morning, UFOs are arriving in D.C. And while their appearance won't be as explosive as the Hollywood hype, today Congress is holding a public hearing on unidentified aerial phenomena, or UAPs, for the first time in 50 years. All in a search for answers to those military sightings that have yet to be explained. <laughs> you probably remember the wild scenes captured by the U.S. Navy and declassified by the Department of Defense last year. <laughs> Those followed up by even more leaked videos from Navy warships showing unidentified objects flying over our seas. What was splashed? Splash. The Pentagon confirmed all of those clips were investigated by a UAP task force, and an intelligence report released last June listed over 140 classified incidents that have baffled the Department of Defense. The way they move can't be explained, and we don't know why that is, uh, but they move in ways uh, that, uh, that aren't consistent with what we understand about physics. Chairman Adam Schiff and Representative Andre Carson are leading Democrats on the subcommittee holding the public hearing. Do you think this could be extraterrestrial life? We don't know, but the focus isn't on extraterrestrials, it's on UAPs, unidentified aerial phenomena that may pose a national security risk. And now with two defense officials set to testify about what's known about UFOs, all eyes are on the hill in the effort to unravel the mystery in our skies. And guys, the congressmen say one of the biggest obstacles to figuring out what's going on is the stigma that comes with talking about UFOs, which they think has prevented other service members from sharing what they might have seen, and they're hoping that this hearing could help change that. Guys, thank you. Yeah, if the truth is out there, then we start to find it out today. Gotti, thank you. All right, let's get it.